Ooh, Blood Lodge. This is our second Blood Lodge game of the day already. I think we've only played four games. Getting Blood Lodge 50% of the time. Mm, I think he's going to go. Oh, my Lord. We missed a gimme. And then we missed another gimme. And then we missed another gimme! One for four on the day. All right. It's all right. We bounce back. We got a rebuttal. One. Two. Three into the fold. Snoop Dogg. Okay. And the bass keeps running, running, and running, running, and running, running. That's a tree. Noise. All right, well, pretty uh, rough start into a heck of a lot of pressure. Uh, I think if we would have understood the situation there a little better. They got her up. I didn't know who to go for. Got his toe beans. Nice. Yeah, this is uh, looking like a pretty good game for us so far. Blood Lodge just had so many alleyways. Oh, that was so nice. Let's go. We're just gonna hug. We don't necessarily want this game to just like end instantly. Okay, wait. I lied. Hold the phone. I see you, buddy. Three, two, one. Nah. Oh, the timing is just too good. We play too much Hunters. And it shows. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this game. Unfortunately, we had a juicer of a game previous to this, but my dumbass forgot to hit the record button. Uh-oh. Thankfully, we noticed our mistake. Jeff had Unbreakable, and we are back in the game. Alrighty then. We're going to hook this and then go for a nice hatchet on this. Is it Felix? Where'd he go? Oh. I can't tell if he's pulling or not. He's not. He knows I have a hatchet. I have a hatchet locked in on him. There it is. I mean, he's not. But yeah, like I said before, this game's just over. I mean, remember they buffed this killer. <laughs> Off the record. Oh, man, I got stuck on the edge of that car. Yeah, there's no reason to, like, pre-hold this truck here. If there wasn't anything in the back of it, it would be fine, but... I think there's, like, a little narrow section you can throw a hatchet through. Like, right there. But... Do we have a hook? I think we make this. Oh, yeah. Nice. Well, if you guys enjoyed the game, please hit the like button. If you want to see more DVD Huntress content, hit subscribe. Appreciate it. We're trying to push out as much content as we possibly can. And it really means a lot, so I appreciate it. Have a good one.
Huntress, we can just chill and kind of hold down certain areas of the map. Um, I don't know if she's behind a rock or not. I know this guy's behind the gen. Not on the side. We have two survivors in the corner. Ooh, we got that right foot. That right toe being you vault. No, you don't. Oh, thought maybe we could clip the hitbox. There, we clipped the hitbox. We do have another survivor still back here. Risky picking up like that with the background player. Uh, Perk being so popular right now, but... That would have been sick. I don't know if they're still behind her, actually. Oh, they are. Run away, Jonah. Okay. Where's our fourth survivor? Distortion? Jonah, I don't know if that's a good spot for you, my guy. Do they peek the corner? Okay, both survivors over here then. Noise! We're gonna try for a lob shot here. Oh! Woo! Baby, that was close. Almost gave him a haircut. That lob shot would have been. Spicy though. I think uh, we hit the rock. Nice little gap between the rock and the building. We'll take it. We're feeling good today. I'm not gonna lie. Been landing a lot of shots, previous games, but we're feeling uh, a little crispy. I was short. Wait. Oh. Dang. Darn. Shucks. I want to go middle and kind of control the map from up here. We have lockers up here as well. It's just a really nice spot. Catch anybody going for the unhook? Or are we just sticking gens? They might all be behind me, to be fair, on this side of the map. Oh, Jonah's gone. Is he the only one going for the unhook? Oh, here we go. Oh, bad aim. Good aim? No. Worse. Yikes. That was a struggle bus for me. Oh no! You know, I said we were feeling good, and now we just start striking out. That's okay. Might be able to find the Easter egg on this map too. We really don't care about this side of the map. I don't think we've chased Nia at all. From the heavens. be out of distortion or uh, yeah distortion stacks doubling up on the gen nope got the 
Oh my gosh. Did I not hit that? Yeah, I could have just not been bad. Still learning that. Um, the distance with these add-ons. Where I need to like be looking. Play, Jonah. You know, he, he reacted very late to that hatchet. Not that one. That one we just, we knew he was watching us, so we knew he was looking at the window, and as soon as he saw us leave the window, he was gonna make his move to create distance. So we just went left of the window and then quickly came back throwing our hatchet where we thought he was gonna be. Uh, we fortunately Hit the shot. Sweet shot. I couldn't see because that vine was in my face. A lot of these shots are just timing. Like, I feel like I've been playing too much Hunters. And I think that goes for any killer. Once you kind of understand how survivors want to play against you, you can kind of manipulate that a little bit. Where the heck... Are they? Oh, cool. Yeah. All right. Well, he is unfortunately going back to the campfire. No, she's not. I'm a ding dong. I thought she went second. Who was that? Oh, they're all on death hook. Okay, so it was the Fang. Someone's gonna go left, right? For sure. No. They're going the long way. Jonah's on top. You can't hit through that, right? Also, one thing you can do too with hunters is uh, throw different velocities of your hatchet. So, like, if survivors are used to you fully cocking your uh, hatchet, they kind of like 
experienced survivors will understand the timing of that so they know how long it will take them to like turn the corner before you can line up like the perfect shot. What you can do sometimes is catch them when they are not necessarily looking at you like with a lob hatchet or something and throw the timing off, which can really uh, be beneficial. I don't know if I explained that the best. Wow, you're sneaky. My tracking's been off today in terms of scratch marks, but that's okay. We were just waiting for the audio cue. That's something we've practiced a lot, by the way. Now again, I think uh, playing against a confident survivor, they understand, or someone who's ha who has the experience against a hunter's kind of gauges your play style as well, so they kind of understand that you're going to be going for shots like that, and they start messing with your head with the audio cues. So sometimes you need to play a little bit more straightforward. You shouldn't be mind gaming everything. It's fun. Let's look for the Easter egg. Maybe we find it before they get hatched. Or maybe we don't. Oh, hatch is here. They brought an offering. Ah. Well, if they run over here, they can have it. Oh, she got it before we got the Easter egg. Well, that's that. Another exciting Huntress game. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you want to see some more DVD Huntress content. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, we are loading into a game. We are now playing Will the Survivor DC. This is no longer Dead by Daylight. It's just Will they DC. I need to turn it into a game show. I literally could do four gens, no one hooked, and then one person goes down and they're just like, you know what? That was some BS. I'm out. Like, why? Ooh, but we got Ormondo beans. That was short. I knew it. As soon as it left my hand. Ooh. Baby, that could have been nice. Drop the pallet. Do it. No? Okay. We're playing this filler. That's nice. Did we drop it now? No? Okay. Now you're dead. Okay, okay. Strong start for me. Maybe a beamer. Kind of just picked up right away. I didn't really peruse the area. We got Horsey Perk. Bane of my existence. You'll hear me say that a lot. I do play on controller, so Horsey Perk OP. Let's see, maybe she drops down. I can hear her above me. This darkness revealed the. Uh, Tracker or not? She went to the hook. Two people at the hook. That's sued. What's going on here? Wait, where's the other one? I thought I saw somebody else run over here. Yeah. Oh, we don't hit that. We might hit this side. Did I push the right side of the hill? I can't see because of the bubble. The Michael Buble. Oh, she knew where I was. That was good of her. She kind of scared me. What was your, your goal? I thought she was going to go right. She goes right here, right? Oof. Maybe we hold that for a little bit. 
Kind of losing all the pressure we have. We let this on the go for free, but Nia's smart. This Nia is not a ding dong by any means. Try to clip the hitbox. What? You know, I said this Nia was smart. Unfortunately, they displayed an act of stupidity. <laughs> I think that's just the caster's curse. Oh. Would would have been nice to hit the Kate, but I kind of just chucked a hatchet, knowing two were over there, they were probably gonna run away. Just kind of like an instinctive toss. She can see me through this crack before I can hit her, so. I would have needed her to overextend. What the hell did I did you happen there? We'll go up on the balcony. Maybe catch somebody rotating from the backside. Yeah. Oh, they were healing at the hook. What are you doing, Kate? Sprint burst? I mean, you're zoning yourself, so thank you. Oh, this filler's pretty good, though. Neo turned into a Kate, which also turned back into a Nia. Hmm. Just stayed at the pallet. Gonna drop it. Yeah. The panic is setting in. This is the. Uh oh. But I will say nobody's DC'd. This has been a fun game. I'm super happy about that. So let's. Uh. Did I just hear Nia? Oh my god, that was abusing the hitbox times a thousand. Decisive. Nope. Yeah, I mean, we're just holding down this side of the map. They're not even doing bad. They got two gens done. Uh, this injury. I don't really care about this Kate. Why would she do that? Okay. I mean, does he have a flashlight? No. Thanks, here. <laughs> I guess body bag. I know they got a pallet connecting into a filler. Uh, I was late on that. That was just poor reaction time. I'm an old man. Distortion? Or is there no locker over here? I think we can hit that if she keeps running. Ugh! Hitbox. Oh. Ah! What the hell? Ah! Ten wood. Plus ten wood. Plus ten wood. Nice. Well, they have successfully passed the challenge of not disconnecting. So, these guys get a gold star. That Kate thinks I'm cheating. Where the heck did Nia go? No, I want Nia. Where's Nia go? Oh. Kate, move. Kate, move, please. Maybe she had like buckle up or something. Mm. 
They didn't DC. They gave up, but they didn't DC. Oh, she's dead, Fang. I think these two I've only hooked once. And we had a pretty dominant performance on Ormond. Granted, you know, this isn't competitive DVD. This is public matches. We're not in the DVD Olympics, so... Would this happen if you were playing Survivor? Probably not, because you guys are the best. But... Who knows? Every squirrel finds a nut. A broken clock is... Right twice a day. Guess we'll give them some points since they've given up. Ooh. Ugh. Just had to hit one nice shot. But now we'll give him hatch. So hopefully you guys enjoy the game. Pretty uh, efficient Huntress game. I'd say. So let me know what you thought. If you guys have been running into issues with survivors or even killers DCing from the game. Uh, once things kind of go the opposite direction. But don't forget to like. If you guys want to see more uh, Huntress or DVD content, subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out and I appreciate it. Thank you guys. Uh, oh, see you, Kate. Have a good time. Or don't. Please leave. Please. Kate. Hatch. In. Please. All right, dude. I guess we're just gonna wait till she bleeds out, or she's gonna wait till she. Oh, thank you, Kate. You're a hero. All right, anyways, thank you guys for watching again. See you.